Underground storage tank or UST owners are required to have a designated operator, typically referred to as a DO. The DO must be formally identified to the Environmental Management Department by the UST owner. The DO must conduct monthly inspections and provide the owner or operator with a written report of their findings. The DO must also train all employees who work at the facility. The DO must possess a current California UST system operator certificate, which is issued by the International Code Council or ICC. ICC certification can be verified at the following website, www.iccsafe.org. Designated operators are required to do each of the following every month. First, record the results from their monthly visual inspection. Second, alert the owner or operator about any condition that may require follow-up action. And finally, conduct and document employee training. The monthly visual inspection includes these seven steps. First, verifying that all employees have been trained and that this training has been documented. Second, reviewing the alarm history or alarm log for the previous month. Third, confirming that each alarm was documented and responded to appropriately. Fourth, examining the spill buckets, which must not contain any hazardous substance, water, or debris. Fifth, checking the under dispenser containment, which like spill buckets, must not contain any hazardous substance, water, or debris. The DO must also verify that sensors are located at the lowest point so that leaks can be detected as soon as they occur. Sixth, checking that all required testing and maintenance was completed and that the correct test dates are documented on the report. And finally, if a containment sump has had an alarm in the past month and there is no record of service, the designated operator must also inspect the sump and document this inspection on the report. As part of the monthly inspection, the DO must also verify that all required testing has been completed and that the correct test dates are properly documented. Secondary containment testing, also known as SB989 testing, should be completed for the entire UST system every 36 months. Only the date of a full test of the entire system should be recorded. Dates of partial tests or retests should not be documented. Some UST systems also require additional special testing. These tests can include those for tank tightness, line tightness, cathodic protection, and enhanced leak detection. The designated operator is responsible for knowing which testing is required and documenting the test results and test dates on the report. A printout of the alarm history must be attached to each monthly report. The designated operator should ensure that each alarm for that month is recorded in the comments section of the report. If the DO discovers any conditions which require follow-up action, the DO must record these on page 2 of the monthly report and must also inform the owner and operator. UST owners and operators should check the designated operator monthly report to make sure they are current, correct, and complete. UST owners and operators must maintain designated operator inspection reports on site for 12 months. While the day-to-day -day tasks related to USTs are done by facility employees, the designated operator is responsible for training them. Each employee must be trained within 30 days after being hired and must then receive a refresher training each year. Training must always include these four elements. How to operate USTs properly using standard best management practices. The employee's role with regard to monitoring equipment. What the employee's role is when spills and overflows occur and the name of the person to contact in case of emergencies or system alarms. There are two additional rules about employees. First, owners and operators should maintain a complete list of employees and be ready to show it to the inspector if asked. Second, whenever operations are underway, there must always be at least one fully trained employee on site. For more information, visit the EMD website at emd.saccounty.net.